I believe in terms of his work and getting time off, hence not being pre-selected, the balls are swooped. Right, guys, while we're here, why don't we head over to one of our first round draft picks. Uh, the fourth pick in the NBL draft, of course, Mecca Vicona with the Nelson Giants. And I think we can cross to Mecca from... Oh, there he is, having a swig, oh, there he is. Now, that is a lie of a background, because I know you're in quarantine, hey. Mecca. There is Mecca Vicona. Why don't you show us the hotel room? <laughs> you didn't want to tidy your hotel room, did you? <laughs> No, I just heard a beach in Nelson. <laughs> but I've got a lot of time to, to think and play around, so, yeah. Hey, Mick, uh, nice things, guys. Uh, really good, man. Uh, great to see you. Thank you so much for taking the time out. But also, um, as a basketball fan, first and foremost for myself, hey, thank you for coming to play in the Sales NBL for 2020, man. Uh, it means a lot to not only fans, but also the league to have someone with your experience and your stature. What does it mean to you to come back and play? Uh, no brainer, really. Um, I'm pretty lucky to be part of a little WhatsApp group with uh, Casey. And when you started hearing these guys start talking about ba playing basketball, how good it was, um, you know, having ten weeks off in isolation, I just couldn't help it. Um, you know, we're pretty lucky to have this all organised, and you know, seeing the draft out here right now, it's a pretty cool thing. So uh, yeah, it was a no brainer for me. It's got to be a little bit of a dream come true to actually come in and get three games a week and limited practices. I mean, uh, this is what I, you, me and you were just talking about this as all we ever wanted when we were playing together, and now it's actually come true for you. Man, it, it, that's a dream situation, bro. All you know, practices like Alan Iverson is just practice, right? You don't need it. Uh, so really looking forward to it and just playing games back-to-back. -back. It's like tournaments that we used to do when we were uh, young kids, so looking forward to it. And one of the things I wonder about with you, Mika, obviously you've got a, a great uh, head for the game. You've got a lot of knowledge in there. Uh, how excited are you to teach that next generation of Nelson basketballer, uh, to share that information that was shared with you as you were coming up and, and help pass that torch for New Zealand basketball? Yeah, that's another big uh, proponent for me coming back as well. You know, um, I felt uh, the year in the ABL was a good learning curve for me still at that age, but it was... Um, just been able to go out and give back what, uh, what I've been able to pick up. You know, uh, when I came through in 2000, it was the Phil Jones, it was uh, Ned Vucinich, Ralph Lattimore, uh, great guys that, were, that was in New Zealand. So hopefully I can, um, I guess, give that back. So looking forward to it, man. Hey, Mecca, thanks very much for your time tonight, mate. Great to see you back. Look forward to seeing you back out on the, on the uh, hardwood. Mecca Vicona there. Thanks, Mecca. Keep working on the tan. The great thing is that Ralph yeah, thanks, <laughs> he, he said Ralph Lattimore. That's gone back. Ralph okay. Lattimore, Nina Bruce, that gold nearer than Nelson. Awesome. The great thing is that his uh, Wi-Fi is as smooth as his free throw. So that's, <laughs> oh, oh, he's oh, gone. Hey. He's gone right. No, he's, he's still, gone, right? no, man. He's still. He's still. He heard that. I hear, wait, I hear he's breaking quarantine to come after. <laughs> <laughs> he would. All right, guys.